Hi, this is Jennifer with creativecricketdesigns.blogspot.com and today I'm going to be making another St. Patrick's Day card. Da, da, da. And that's my son Austin who decided to join me today in making my card adventure. Hi. And what I did is I used the Lacy Labels cartridge to cut out my card base and it's um, called Asian and let me see, I can probably show it to you guys. Let's see. It's this one right here. The one that says Asian. And my sizes I created on my Gypsy, so the size of my card base is um, 5 inches by 3.53 wide. And then I just copied it and then I uh, welded it together. On the one side, I have some stitching around the edges, and I use some. Um, twine from the twinery at the top of it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my layers together. So I have a piece of black cardstock that I also stitched around the edges and this is the first layer and this is at 3.35 width by four and a quarter or four and three quarters height. And then my other layer is 3.18 width by four and a half inches height. So it would actually be, you know, like when I created it, I created it this way, but I'm going to have the card actually be this way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put these pieces together. I'm just using my ATG gun. Works well. <laughs> So there's my first layer and then I'm going to go ahead and attach it to my card base. So then this is what the front of the card will look like. And then what I did is I cut out the shamrocks that are on the Celebrate with Flourish Cricut Light cartridge. And those are, let's see, right here on the um, light cartridge. And I cut those at two and a half see I just kind of measured them on how I want them to fit on here and then I just cut them out on my uh, expression but they're cut at two and a half on the expression and then I have them up on some pop dots and I'm not sure exactly where I'm gonna put them so we're just gonna kind of work with it and then I receive my um, stamps from my creative time the I believe in leprechauns and I went ahead and created this label it's actually with the same, like the Asian um, label, but when I made it smaller, it didn't quite take the shape of the card. Um, so the first, the black layer is cut at 2.31 width by 0.87 height, and the green piece is cut at 2.15 width and 0.62 height. And then I stamped my sentiment that says, have a shamrockin' day. And then I stitched the green and the black. And those are going to go on the card. And I'm thinking I might just set, put everything in the center so it will kind of even out together. And I'm going to pop dot that up as well, I believe. So I'm going to get some foam squares. And I already have my other ones on the um, squares and dots. I'm going to go ahead and center this on here. And then I'm going to get my um, backing off of this one. And then I'm just going to go ahead and place them on the card. Mm -hmm. 
like so. So that's going to be the finished card. Da, da, da. So I thank you very much for watching and have a great day.